आई पी आर लॉज विद शिवार्थी बजाज एंड माई नेम इज कबीर एंड टूडे very interesting topics before that let me introduce you to shivarti bajaj co-founder managing partner of rsd bajaj global and iniva ye mujhe likhna padta hai kyunki mera dimag you know how it is shivarti aapko kaisa lagta hai jab main aapko introduce karta hu bahut acha introduction karta hu nahi not really no no kabir uh, firstly it's a pleasure to be in conversation with you at okay. red uh, red fm has been very kind Oh. And, oh. <laughs> thanks for coming and actually no, no. sharing uh, the knowledge on so, this particular subject. These are very small issues. ये सब चलता है, ठीक है. Okay, yeah. so what we are doing today is there a lot to cover, uh, but three major things: geographical indications, traditional knowledge, and trade secrets. Hmm. We we'll start with geographical indications. What it is like मेरे को जब बोला था geographical indications और IPR पी आर के अंडर तो मुझे लगा था जी पी एस तो नहीं है गूगल मैप्स की तो नहीं बात कर रहे हैं है क्या ये वॉट इज इट ओके सो जी पी एस वॉज एक्चुअली अ गुड एनालॉजी दैट यू ड्रू ओके जस्ट स्पीक्स वॉल्यूम्स अबाउट यूर इंटेलिजेंस थैंक यू येस बिकॉज जोग्राफिकल इंडिकेशन बेसिकली आर इंडिकेटर्स दैट आइडेंटिफाई विद अ प्रोडक्ट or a particular thing originating from a territory area so, se yes so geographical indications hmm. are basically indicators so indications hmm. are indicators hmm. uh, which uh, uh, tell us whether it's a region or locality or a territory hmm. that gets a reputation for a particular thing acha uh, where it originates from L- it is uh, okay originating from uh, some like area a region uh, like region. champagne the wine uh, so it's from a region uh, champagne in france मधुबनीस्ट from that perspective now okay. the darjeeling tea was one of the first gi's and uh, it is basically the tea that grows in darjeeling absolutely and uh, the interesting fact about gi is that it is owned by an organization hmm. um more than one person basically yeah that's, that's what i was coming to yes. ki jo gi hai hmm. ye jo geographical indication hai hmm. उसके लिए कोई फाइल करेगा कि भाई दार्जिलिंग टी टी जो दार्जिलिंग से आई इसको दार्जिलिंग टी एंड वी विल यूज दिस एज अ जी आई एज अ पार्ट ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट एंड समबडी सिटिंग इन कनेक्टिकेट इन यूएस कैन नॉट राइट इफ आई अंडरस्टैंड करेक्टली यू आर राइट सो हु कैन फाइल फॉर इट बिकॉज दिस इज अ वेरी जेनरिक थिंग राइट जैसे बनारसी साड़ी हो गया या फिर मधुबनी पेंटिंग्स हो गया हाउ हाउ डज द फाइलिंग प्रोसीजर वर्क और हु कैन फाइल फॉर इट्स अ कम्युनिटी that files for it like the the arjling tea is owned by the tea board and Achha. the government to a certain extent okay. so it's a board it's a community now the banarsi sarees would be a community of people who are uh, protecting their uh, particular art in a way okay. that whole community uh, owns the gi to use that now there, there is again a very thin line between uh, usage of a gi and a trademark haan, haan. something like lipton darjling tea haan. right now lipton is the trademark Okay. Right, and Darjeeling tea is the GI. Hmm. So when when they are using Darjeeling tea, it 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 is a either is a known fact that they're doing it with Darjeeling tea as hmm. a GI, hmm. or there is some arrangement in terms of a contract, etc., for Lipton to use that GI. Okay. okay? And uh, similarly, um, it would be like uh, suppose in Europe, someone selling the Darjeeling tea. So the 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 reason for GI is that they should know that it is not uh, uh, you know uh, selling fakes to a certain degree. Uh, okay. Uh, claiming it to be of that origin, special origin of that place. Okay. So that's the purpose of a GI. It is it is a huge uh, uh, asset. for the particular uh, area and community uh-huh. for them to protect their culture it has huge value in terms of 
that aspect as well what will be the examples of uh, you know indications which are not uh, registra- registrable like you cannot register these things like uh if scratching any just product, the surface uh, yeah any product causing hurting religious sentiments oh. uh, deceiving a community or uh, uh, being fake uh, or um, something that's contrary to public morality things like that yes okay so जैसे दार्जिलिंग टीम में आपने बताया कि बोर्ड ने फाइल कर रखा है भाई कम्युनिटी है दे ओन द राइट्स टू दिस जीआई जियोग्राफिकल इंडिकेटर बट व्हाट आर द राइट लाइक व्हाट आर द राइट्स दैट यू नो दैट पर्टिकुलर बोर्ड और दैट पर्टिकुलर कम्युनिटी हैज व्हेन दे फाइल फॉर अ जीआई आई मीन लेजिटली एंड इट्स देयर्स व्हाट आर द राइट्स दैट दे हैव सो इंटेलेक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी राइट्स एज एन ambit like as an umbrella hmm. gives you a protection to use a particular right hmm. and uh, protect the infringement and Achha. hold an answerability for a, a person infringing you know it does not enable the holder to prevent someone from making hmm. Hmm. a product using the same technique hmm. as those set out in the particular Achha. standards for indications but hmm. however uh, it usually is obtained by acquiring a right o- over the sign that constitutes the indication which basically means that uh, you know uh, if a third party is infringing that particular thing it gives you the tool to say that aye aap hamara infringe kar rahe ho If we take the same example, अगर यूरोप में डार्जिलिंग टी कोई कंपनी बेच रही है सो दे हैव टू एफकोर्स लाइक मैनुफैक्चर इट इन दार्जिलिंग एंड टेक लाइसेंसिंग ऑल्सो फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर कम्युनिटी एंड द बॉडी लाइसेंसिंग सी दार्जिलिंग टी विल बी यूनिक टू द दार्जिलिंग प्लेस so as it says the it's unique to a place like the hmm. banarasi sari will be unique to banaras the uh, alfonso mango would be unique in a particular way the nagpur orange will be unique in a particular okay. taste okay. Uh, the uh, agra petha um, ah, is me. unique to it's agra unique. Yeah. so s- s- stuff like that you can't really replicate the soil the environment it has uh, to come from if there. it's food if it's uh, artisan hard work like your madhubani Got paintings it. where will you get those artists from so that it's basically a cultural protection to give a high value to the ch- supply chain it uh, helps in uh, like you were asking me about the advantages so wo ek high value chain ho jati hai to the user hmm. uh, to the makes sense originator in a makes great sense. like way. because it is unique to them to that ge- geographical location yes and any case laws which has happened around gi like this is a famous rasgulla case uh, between uh, okay. uh, uh, bengal and odisha trying to reduce uh, my calorie intake but theek okay, let's talk about rasgulla yeah so, so between uh, bengal and uh, odisha where in they say that there was a rasgulla hmm. how what should it be called and Achha. wo kiska gi hai huh. then ultimately it was settled as bengal uh, rasgulla and uh, odisha um, i think it was Bengal Rasgulla and Orissa Rasgulla, but the Rasgulla term was kept neutral because it's neutral. Because it's but if you could prefix it from that particular name of the state or word, that would become uh, a GI of that state. So it was one of the interesting cases that happened. That's interesting. Yeah. Uh, what is the way to go about, uh, you know, registering a GI? Like, is there a process? Yes. And w- I mean, is it like forever or? like what happens like let's say if somebody like for dajling tea the the board that you were talking about mm. they registered it right huh. so for they can register it for how long and how 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 is the continuity how does it goes on and on for years because dajling tea abhi ki thodi na hai to kai saalon ki hai na that's a very good question protection of the timeline is a very important aspect it's hmm. 10 years right now okay. and uh, it but it can be renewed uh, renewables it's called renewables they can be filed to extend the timeline to 10 10 years so usually a board might uh, renew it every 10 years every yes. decade yes most people most uh, communities do because that's where the value lies at there must be some exceptions of course uh, under uh, you know geographical indications are there any exceptions like ki bhai ye nahi ye chalega ho sakta hai nahi ho sakta uh, there are few exceptions uh, in the trips agreement uh, okay. but uh, those are mostly when there are uh, something that has become too generic to fall Achha. under the ambit of Achha. gi but that has to be it's it's case to case matter to matter yeah. okay yeah. so uh, 
बट देर आर थिंग्स विच कैन बी जेनरिक और उसको आप नहीं कर सकते कि भाई बोल दिया जैसे कि भोपाल का बादाम जिसे आप कुछ चीज को गुड फेथ या इट बिकम्स टू जेनेरिक सो बट दैट हैज टू बी वेट यू नो या नाउ दैट वी नो व्हाट इज जियोग्राफिकल इंडिकेटर्स हाउ इज इट डिफरेंट फ्रॉम अ ट्रेडमार्क वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन कबीर अ ट्रेडमार्क एज वी डिस्कस्ड इन द प्रीवियस एपिसोड्स इज अ साइन और अ is for an enterprise or a good and a services a, a mark hmm. it can be a name it can be a logo hmm. uh, it can hmm. be a phrase uh, hmm. which gives the owner the exclusive Thakbu. rights uh, the the one that we talked about aisa koi yeah. saga nahi jisse humne thaga nahi can be a trademark uh, and trademark in a lot of cases can be an individual right also hmm. gi on is a, is a, a, about the source of origin the area Where hmm. it's coming from, hmm. like your. So there are more parties involved. More parties yeah. involved, and it's uh, specific to that area, that region. It's Got more it. static, and it is uh, community owned. And like a trademark can be more fluid and imaginary. That comes with a deeper story in terms of a um, geographical indication. And like a trademark, which you can think of something and go ahead and say, okay, this is unique. I'm going to hmm. file this name. Then how does traditional knowledge plays in? Because that is also a very important hmm. part, right? Hmm. Like. Hmm. ट्रेडिशनल नॉलेज कहाँ पे आ गया है एपीआर में ओके या सो ट्रेडिशनल नॉलेज इज अनदर लेग व्हिच डील्स विद बेसिकली जिसे हम कहते हैं दादी माँ के नुस्खे Hmm. Uh, you know, the uh, the stories that have been passed on from our grandparents in terms okay. of nuskas. Not even India mein nahi, bahar bhi, I'm sure har country ke hote apne. Uh, 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 us, hai, traditional knowledge. Hmm. Now, IP में कैसे आती है बिकॉज आई पी आर इज अबाउट इंटेलेक्चुअल क्रिएशन Okay. Right, it, uh, something that is created from your intellect, and hmm. how do you protect it? Hmm. Right. So how it falls in IPR is because a lot of things that people feel they have discovered right now. Hmm. Hmm. I've used the word discovered because discovery per se cannot be uh, an invention. Okay. Right. Hmm. Uh, is not an invention. It is not. Yeah. Agree. Uh, a very popular case in this case was the Haldi case. Hmm. Like uh, um, uh, Haldi was uh, patented in the US. सो गोल्डन मिल्क लैटे कह रहे हैं तो विच इज बेसिकली विच इज हल्दी का दूध ना इट्स टाइम इम मेमोरियल इन इंडिया सबको पता है मतलब आपके नेफ्यू नीस को भी पता होगा कि हाँ अगर हल्दी का दूध पी लो कोई बेनिफिट है इसका सो वेन यू हैज पेटेंटेड इट देन काइंड ऑफ इंडिया गॉट अ वेकन टू द realization that okay hmm. this is getting out of hand uh, because india your all these countries like see medicinal properties and healing properties hai ab hame to pata hai wo hmm. so, there something known as prior art search so uh, now uh, to prove ki this is existing as a prior art huh. uh, what, what uh, it was a very good initiative huh. obviously haldi was challenged huh. and it was uh, uh, closed in terms of the patent being revoked or a limited claim being given and hmm. uh, so uh, similarly was uh, the case of neem also acha hmm? neem bhi kar liya ha neem bhi <laughs> ki uh, ye healing hai antiseptic hai mere humne ka humse poocho kya kya hai abhi to aapko pata hi nahi hai your our uh, our uh, your mother will tell you more than, uh, than your research your, will your research <laughs> ever people, will yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, so you know like that so things like that got uh, the government concerned the csir along with the uh, you know ayush ministry they they build the tkdl library the traditional knowledge digital library acha there is a library which is a huge move hmm. a huge move uh, hmm. because it basically allows uh, an access to hmm. your uh, uh, knowledge base which has existed in india From time immemorial, hmm. but वो language अलग होती थी The language used to be Sanskrit. Uh, it's not only covering Ayurveda; it's covering Yunani, it's covering Siddhi, it's covering Yog. So it's covering a lot of things. Like things covering some ninety-three thousand plus Ayurvedic uh, concoctions, uh, around two lakh Yunani or one like seventy-five thousand Yunani. Uh, you know, like that twenty-three thousand Siddhi. And who has access uh, to these libraries? It's publicly available. Uh, you can, and it's available in multiple languages for hmm. other offices also to access, okay. like in Spanish, in Japanese, etc. Okay. 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 Okay.
इट्स बी नोन की हाँ ये तो होता ही है अश्वगंधा का फोकस मोर इट्स नोन अब हम उसे सप्लीमेंट कहते हैं बट इट्स अ नोन थिंग ट्रू सो ऐसी चीजें यू नो अ पर्सन टू पेटेंटेड इट एंड देन हैव अ मोनोपोली ओवर इट इज नॉट राइट सो फ्रॉम दैट परस्पेक्टिव दिस लाइब्रेरी इज यूजफुल एंड दैट्स वट वी कॉल एज ट्रेडिशनल नॉलेज सो ये दिस प्रोटेक्ट दिस इज आई एम स्पीकिंग फ्रॉम द परस्पेक्टिव ऑफ इंडिया राइट नाउ सो इंडिया में दिस लाइब्रेरी एग्जिस्ट एंड इट हैज मूवड इन अ ह्यूज वे फॉर अदर सच पैटर्न और अदर सच प्रोटेक्शन टू कम इन टू प्लेस एंड इट हैज वर्क वंडर्स इन टर्म्स ऑफ इंटेलेक्चुअल प्रॉपर्टी बींग लिमिटेड और प्रोटेक्टेड फॉर नोन ट्रेडिशनल नॉलेज ऑफ इंडिया कि आप गिर गए और उठ गए तो उस पर नीम लगा लो यू नो हल्दी का दूध पी लो तो ऑल दीज थिंग्स ये सब पता है तो ये अब हमसे कोई लेके उस पे एक्सक्लूसिव राइट क्लेम करे अगर सो इट्स टू प्रोटेक्ट दैट इज वेर ट्रेडिशनल नॉलेज कम्स इन टू प्ले नेक्स्ट सब्जेक्ट विच यू वॉन्ट टू कवर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट लाइक यू नो एवरीबडी एंड एवरीबडी बिलीव लाइक यू नो स्पेसिफिकली स्टार्टअप में ना काफी लोग आजकल ना बिलीव करते हैं कि ये तो मेरा ट्रेड सीक्रेट है लेट्स नॉट टॉक अबाउट इट लेट्स नॉट टॉक अबाउट इट या so under ipr intellectual property rights hmm. what exactly are trade secrets okay uh, so uh, trade secrets is something which as the name gives away is a secret hmm. of a particular trade hmm. now a trade is a business or any form of trade that can be hmm. uh, and uh, when when i say secret is something that is not known to the public at large it's okay. it's not uh, published in any form okay. and it has to be commercially valuable and it is known to limited number of people to Achha. run that commercially vi- viable proposition acha and uh, yeah uh, and that's it and so, and there are enough uh, uh, there are enough uh, actions done to keep it a trade secret in terms of contracts within oh. the uh, group of people um, known so let's uh, say coke ka formula hmm. hai na hmm. kisi ko malum nahi ki uska specifically uh, kitna yeah. kya dalta hai hmm. will that be a trade secret yes that's uh, in fact a very famous example of uh, a trade secret Uh, people who know the trade secret don't travel in the same plane at the same time acha yeah these are Taki. the these are the uh, actions they take to protect and uh, whoever knows the formulation takes uh, steps to protect it and uh, but ye tech mein bhi bahut zyada play hota hai like um, i'll give the example of uh, google's algorithm hmm. nobody knows how it works nobody knows how it works and it's regularly updated सो अब हर बार वो करेंगे हर बार उसे पब्लिश करेंगे सो नो बडी नोज द गूगल अलगोरिथम इट्स अ वेरी वेल नोन ट्रेड सीक्रेट नॉट नोन ट्रेड सीक्रेट लाइक हाउ दे ऑपरेट नो बडी नोज ट्रेड सीक्रेट वाई इज द प्रोडक्शन ऑफ ट्रेड सीक्रेट इंपॉर्टेंट लाइक यू नो आपने बोल तो दिया कि चलो ठीक है ग्यारह हर्ब्स एंड स्पाइसिस बट वाई द प्रोडक्शन इज इम्पॉर्टेंट लाइक कमर्शली वैल्यूएबल Achha. It has to be commercially Majorly. valuable. Yes. Majorly, yes. the reason will be that uh, it's not like what uh, two girls spoke each other. Like a gossip is not a trade secret, or two boys exchange information on a particular uh, person. If two boys or two girls are gossiping, that's not trade secret. But if it has some commercial value to it, are there any known trade secret uh, you know uh, filed in India? Like. so uh, a trade secret will per se never be filed because if you file it hmm. then it uh, it's open for public uh, introspection and public okay. use a lot of manufacturing companies so trade secret is not only food right it can, can be, be a, a process also. it can be a process at a manufacturing unit it can be oh. uh, data related to client client data in a particular firm uh, so a trade secret yeah. rehta kitne time tak like list of ex- supplies okay. um, uh, your advertising strategies All these can be trade secrets. So yeah. if I as a normal person hmm. challenge कि भाई ये trade secret has been around for last thirty forty years now it should be out in the public. Hmm. Can I do that or uh, I no. mean what happens? Uh, so trade secret per se uh, uh, is a right which is never filed but it is yours by way of protection by way hmm. of pe- not enough people knowing about it. Okay. So if there are there is only a group of people who know about it, hmm. it's a secret till the time they are able to keep a secret. Okay. Mm. but what are the ways to protect it like are there any legal there are, ways uh, yes there are contracts there are, uh, uh, a lot of times the copyright act comes into play the indian, uh, indian penal code comes into play okay. the indian contract act comes into play the competition act etc you know uh, there are a lot of acts that come into play in terms of uh, protecting a trade secret in uh, uh, between that particular group yeah and if there is infringement for example coke ka composition hai mm. mere ko malum chal gaya mm. 
आर देर एनी लॉज इन प्ले वॉट हैपन्स लाइक मेरे को मालूम चल गया कैसे भी मालूम चल गया इफ यू नो द एग्जैक्ट Uh, exact composition. So, firstly, they'll question the people who know the exact uh, composition. Then, how did it go Haan. out? Haan. Absolutely. Uh, so, uh, if it goes out through, obviously, it'll go out through the. Hmm. Suppose there are three people who know it, right? And if it's if one of them has uh, leaked it, hmm. then they would know that person. That person would be held answerable in terms of the whatever in a contract they have. Kaise bahar gaya? Uh, yeah. But what I want to know is, can I float a, a product? which has let's say you, you have a company you have a trade secret i come to know of it and i float a product or a company using the same trade secret will you be able to sue me if you can crack it you go ahead and float it ah so that is why it's kept very tight so, you know we we know there are uh, chefs who just come and make the base uh, uh, recipe and then then it's distributed from that particular point hmm. to the various outlets so uh-huh. pr- sometimes there's only so one person who knows know. that hmm. uh, in terms of manufacturing there's a particular oil that's being manufactured or there's a particular ointment that's being manufactured hmm. sometimes it's a trade secret where the composition is only known to one or two people so yeah. okay as a conclusion what i really want to know from you is do you think it's progressive to have trade secrets uh, uh that's debatable because hmm. um Uh, in terms of other protections also you have to out your uh, inventions or you have to out yeah. your uh, recipes or your, your uh, the way the things that you are wanting to protect hmm. but that needs uh, again that gives you an exclusive right hmm. so that but that's timed like a patent is timed for 20 years okay Interesting, yeah. so, but law comes in play because the way you want to keep it. The way you want to keep it, what are in a contracts? आपके uh, mm. within the uh, tight knit uh, people, what is the kind of IP or non IP mm. laws that are coming to play that you're doing to protect? If that particular yeah. leaves the organization, then they come under the law that they will not be able to share the. There is there are NDAs, there are non competes, mm. uh, you know, non disclosure agreements. non compete agreements etc there are many things that go into play to protect elon musk ne apni team walon ka bahut karwa rakha hoga na ye sab because the way they use batteries <laughs> for their electric vehicle i am i can only imagine isne itne ke itne ek sign karwaye honge na oh yeah of course i mean uh, especially if uh, अब अनलेस वो पेटेंट कर नहीं करवा रहा है अपनी इन्वेंशन को तो वो कुछ तो करेगा टू प्रोटेक्ट अदरवाइज एवरी टॉम डिक एंड हैरी इन द स्ट्रीट विल वॉक आउट वॉक आउट जॉइन अ होंडा एंड लाइक हाँ मैं बताता हूँ ये ऐसे बना रहा है <laughs> तुम भी बनाओ रॉकेट बनाए रॉकेट ऐसे बनाना है <laughs> Cool. So that's uh, uh, Shivarti Bajaj. Shivarti, there was a very nice, interesting session. Uh, how can somebody you, reach Kabeer. you guys if they just want, you know, more information generally about all these interesting topics? Sure. Um, they can send us an email at rsd at rsdbajajglobal dot com, and of course, all the social media handles are brilliant. Active. Coming up next, uh, we have one more very interesting podcast for you, but we'll let you know what it is. in the next episode thank, thank you kabir it's a pleasure 3.5 red fm 3.5 bajate raho <laughs>